there were two items added this talk like a pirate day that I didn't expect to be added and that is kind of interesting because I usually expect most of the items but I really like it when they add items that are very unexpected so let's take a look at them okay real quick uh this is what the thumbnails will look like for the foreseeable future uh with the watermark in the top corner there the watermark looks a little different than on this picture uh with the glowing on the white part that's not there anymore but uh, this watermark right here will be on all the videos for future. That's just a small little channel thing update and uh, I might remove it at one point But I'll update you guys if I do all right to get these items You're gonna want to slash showing kaiju war or go where I'm going right now click in right there if it's the current event and Then doing a lot of running, you know gotta get the leg workout in and you got to run all the way to the end and defeating enemies is part of that Hopefully when they update to the 60 FPS client and they have more control over their game engine, uh, they can make it so it saves that you defeated the enemies in an area. So every time you log in and log, log out and back in, uh, that progress will be saved. That would be a nice feature to be added to the game in the future. Hopefully we'll see that one day. Alright, you'll get to the first boss room and go left here. And there will be this guy. This is the actual boss for the event, of course. And this is a really cool map. It's gonna be, I'm going to be sad when this map is rare. Uh, let's slash sleep here Very cool map, but uh, off this guy there are two helmets very unique helmets that were added for this event So uh, let's go to white map and check this out. They both drop off this guy. Let's go check them out All right, the first helmet is top of your inventory the banana split one Hair's color custom and you got an ice cream on your head, of course uh, So I didn't make videos on the other Talk about pair day items from the previous events because uh, they're not really that special and you probably know about them but you could have overlooked something like this but if you farm the boss you probably found it already on your own and there is also a messy banana split which the only difference is of course the hairstyle change and that hair of course is color custom so those are the two highlights i want to show make sure you guys don't miss them make sure you get them they are non-member ac tags so you can store those in your bank even if you don't want to have them equipped but uh, I definitely wanted to get them when they came out. So of course you can color customize your hair so it can look and match any color. And uh, the color on here really matches the new Paladin Naval Commander that was added in this update if you got that. So if you want a cool helmet to match the color, that gray matches pretty well with the Paladin Naval Commander. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace. The way I saw a few people comment on my videos that they couldn't get this to drop from the monster, it's confirmed rare. Uh, it was a mistake, I think, that they put in the game. But I think what would be really cool is uh, if they made this version stay rare just by name, not change any of the visuals or anything, and make the other one named like the Kaiju Pirate Hat or something like that, and the Rogue Pirate Hat stays rare, and uh, people that got it can keep it as the rogue pirate hat to have a cool rare item for being one of the first people to farm the boss uh, from the TLAPD event. That'd be cool, but that's just a suggestion. It doesn't have to actually go through like that. But uh, yeah, that's just a little update on that. If you guys were farming for that hat, it's no longer in the game. Have a good one. Peace.